Okay, I, I don't care what you're doing right now. Come to the TV here. Just stop for a second. What are you doing? Oh my goodness. Slightly <laughs> tilt your head and check this out. Do you know what it is a cake? Wow. But doesn't that look like something dreams are made of? Isn't that spectacular? I'm still looking at it. This is the <laughs> genius behind that cake. Yeah, <laughs> Tiffany Baird is the owner of Coco Couture, and she joins us in the Kirby and Holloway kitchen to sweeten up this Wednesday. Um, you, that cake's for me, right? 21 for my 21st yes, birthday. Yeah, yeah okay. Yeah, uh, we're starting one. off with one of your most popular items. This is a strawberry crunch yes. cheesecake, yes. right? Yes. Oh my goodness, so you're gonna, we're gonna make it. Mm -hmm. Okay, so what are we gonna, where do we start? So first you're gonna put uh, four cubes of cream cheese. This is four. Philadelphia, yeah, Phil the best. Four eight ounce. Yes. Wow. Ma yeah. Do your math there, Jimmy. How yeah. much, how many ounces of cream uh, cheese I'll, is I'll that? I'll do it here in a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and then just yes. go ahead and kind of. Yeah. You wanna put that one Yeah, there. whip it up a little bit. Yeah. You can turn it up some. So anything in particular I would be doing? Uh, yes, so you, you're gonna do the crust for the, the crust. cheesecake. Yes. And you want to pour this spray first. And what is that? This is graham cracker crust. Okay. So that goes um, in the bottom. Yep, that goes in the bottom, but you have to mix it with some butter. And I usually put a little bit of cinnamon in it uh, just to give it a little taste. Okay. So mix all that in the bowl and then put it in. Yep. Okay. Should gotcha. I be you putting anything else in here? No, you want to whisk just it up. Just whip it all up. You can turn it up a little higher. Okay. You just means everyone has did to talk a little louder. Yes. Did she really just say just whip it good? Is that what whip you, it. she I really did, did say? I that, did. Whip, whip it good. good. <laughs> <laughs> no wonder how right. we entertain ourselves. Gotta check here. this over here. Okay, you can turn that down. Good, because it started flying <laughs> everywhere. Yeah. That's the fun okay. part. Okay, you want to. Oh, okay. We want to change. Yep. Change. Not yet. Oh, not yet. Okay. Nope. You can lift it up though. So oh. You can pour the sugar in. <laughs> Now you said we're saving this for later, right? Yes, that's okay. what that's going to be the topping so that goes the with crust. the sugar and all that. That's a lot of sugar. Yeah. Well, well yeah. it's just one and a fourth cup. Oh, unless, okay. Unless you want to um, just cheesecake, you know, cream no, cheese. No, no, we want sugar. Cheesecake. Okay, <laughs> just the sugar and then yep. continue whipping. You can put that back on. Okay. Look at you. You're a, a master over here. Yeah, but they don't want me to toss salad anymore. <laughs> we have to take it off the lights too many times. There we go. That's fine. Otherwise, I will be wearing cheesecake. <laughs> Now this is kind of dry. How do, do, is this? How well, I want the it? butter the butter is going to melt. It's going to get softer in it. So oh, okay, it's fine. okay. Yeah, gotcha. And then you're going to pour that in there. Once you incorporate that all the way, you're going to pour that inside that pan. That's uh, and then you're going to press it down and make like a little a little hole in it. Make it make a layer. Yep. Gotcha. Pour that down there. Okay. Okay. Now over here, you can pour your eggs, and you can actually leave that on there if you okay. want, and just pour the pour eggs the right eggs in there. Here. How many? Yep. One, two, three, one four, at five. a time. You can leave it on on low. Oh, on low. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> There you go. Uh, Try and incorporate one at a time. Oh, well, well that was two at a That's time. <laughs> and, and once you see those are incorporated, you can just go to the next one. Okay. Now, should I be doing this with my hands? Yeah, you can. I can? Okay. Yep. I'm going to go and get some gloves. Okay. Yeah. Oh. No, I got that. You got it. So, am I to understand, you don't actually have a shop. You're a pop-up shop? Yes, I'm a pop-up shop. What does that mean exactly? So, I basically do a lot of vending events mm -hmm. um, at like, um, that's why I do daycares, or if you're having like a, a girls' night, I'll mm -hmm. come there. You know, we can do cake decorating. We all, I also do um, events like they had a Della Donna event, a women's conference yeah, over the weekend. Yeah, yeah. So I did a pop up shop there. Did very, very well. Oh, that's neat. So you go to them. Yep. Yeah. Anywhere they are, I'm there. You're and there. Also on um, like Wednesdays, I typically go out in the neighborhood and I have slices of cheesecake, cookies. I have all types of mm. specialty cookies, like banana pudding, strawberry crunch, uh, cookies and cream cookies. Do you know where Jimmy's neighborhood is? Where is that? <laughs> Wherever you're part. <laughs> okay. All right. So, um, okay, so. Okay, so. We need a spatula? Yes. Oh, okay. I'm going to probably find that. have one right there. One right. This is fine. How did you learn to, when did you start baking? Why did you start baking? Um, this has always been a love for me since I was like seven years old. Really? Um, yeah. I've been baking since I was like seven. But professionally, I just started in October of last year. So you turned a young passion into something profitable. Yes. That's pretty cool. Yes. So has it been a learning experience? Definitely. <laughs> a, a lot, especially since the weather's been changing, I've had some experiences. Oh, yeah. Um, I, it's, it's trial and error, but it's still fun. It's still you know? fun. Yeah, I can do this for free. Is this all right? Yeah, that's good. You don't want to leave any like cracks or holes oh, in it because oh, the cheesecake will go right through it. There you go. All right, so but how, that looks good. How do we look here? Do we All right, anything? so you want to lift this up and you want to scrape the sides. Okay. This thing doesn't want to stay. Yeah. Okay. I feel like I'm working for my cheesecake here. You yeah, are you working got for to. your cheesecake. 
All right, okay. that looks good. So what we would do is typically I would put this in the oven for about 15, 12 to 15 minutes, right. just to let that crust bake a little bit, okay. and then I'll let it cool. And then once she's done with that, we'll pour that inside that the crust. That goes in. Yep. Okay. Okay, I'm working on it, Jimmy. All right, I'm gonna unglove here. She's getting here. there. <laughs> can I unglove, Mark? Right? Yeah, you're good to go. Okay. All right, you okay. can put your sour cream in whenever you're ready. Yeah. Am I ready? Yeah, you're ready. Go ahead. There you go. And you, you can do. Uh oh, that was a good catch. That was a good catch. That was pretty impressive, right I'll there. I'll that for you. Okay. And, and then, then this is heavy, heavy whipping cream. Heavy whipping cream. Yep. It makes the cream cheese more creamier. Oh. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then what do we have here? Uh, two teaspoons of organic vanilla. Organic vanilla. Yep. Just go ahead and put it in. Yes, ma'am. So if this TV thing doesn't work out, are you hiring? <laughs> <laughs> I do need some help. Yeah. <laughs> Boom, okay. done. So, once right, this so is, you want to scrape the sides down. You want to make sure that everything's incorporated. So once this is mixed, it's going to go, you say it's going yes. to go on top of that? Mm -hmm. All right. And then what? And then it goes? It goes into the oven at 350 for an hour. Uh -huh. And then after the hour, we usually put this um, bacon strip. Now, typically people would use like aluminum foil and do like a water bath. Right. But I figured out a better way without all that old school stuff. So this is a bacon strip. You just make sure this is wet. You can feel it. It's a wet strip. You wet it. Yeah. And then you just wrap it around, and it still holds that moisture, and your cake, your or cheesecake won't crack. Really? Yeah. So right. you do that. Well, I'll tell you what. We're going to uh, go ahead and take a break, and then we're okay. going to come back, and we're going to see the finished product and taste it. And then we're making brown butter chocolate chip cookies next. Yeah. You do not want to miss one sweet, bright bite. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Stay tuned. Don't Marvel Life will be right back. I love that. <laughs>